Hello everyone, this is Coffee Jugget. I just wanted to share with you another little tip that I use when it comes to using my Windows 10 and my Surface Pro 3. So my school district uses Google, and so we use Google Calendar and Google Email and all those things quite a bit. However, I'm always looking for ways to integrate the things that I love about my Surface and the things that I love about Windows 10 and mixing it with Google and the features that are, that are pretty good there as well. And so what I want to share with you today was how to coordinate all your calendars. So if you go to the, your start option, you go to your calendar. Now I've already done all this, but for you, one of the things I want to do is see everything in, in one location. I mean, I'm not going to be able to just stop using Google Calendar because that's what my school uses. So I go down here to this gear and I choose accounts. <clears throat> you're going to see that I've already synced up my two Gmail accounts, uh, my personal and my school. What you can do is click this add account and you can add whatever account it is that you use, uh, whether it's iCloud, Google Exchange, or your Outlook. And you add all that. Um, I'm not going to add one now because I don't have any others to add. And it'll sync up. It'll ask you to click the blue allow button to read into that, that tab. And then you're going to be in great shape and your calendar will start to look like mine where all the calendars that you've created, you can see here my Gmail, all my calendars that I use, as well as my school, I've got all my things here as well. And now I've got just one location where everything is at. And that makes it really, really nice when it comes to using the best of both worlds. Once you have your calendars integrated, the other beauty is that you can then add your own events so um, let's go ahead and do that now hey Cortana add event date November 21st 9 a.m. drink coffee yes and you can see that it's there um, what it did if you if you notice that it, it syncs to your last calendar that you use so the last calendar I used was my coffee chug calendar um, I could go back in there um, and change that so hey Cortana add event Hey Cortana, add event, add event, all right so you can see that I can right here then I can choose whatever calendar I would like, these are all my calendars that I have. And so you can have those options, but it'll always default to the last one that you used. So now, when I go back to my calendar, all right, my events will pop up. And so I've got my Iowa email, and I've got all my things that I need uh, for the day. So just a really, really helpful tip for you to have as you're working through trying to make sense of all the calendars using the tools that you like and the tools that you have to use um, just to help make sense of the world around you. Hope you found this helpful. Let me know if you have any questions, tips, or ideas, and always looking forward to learning along with you. Have a great day.